All right, it's time for the Kelly Williams Show. Yay! Okay, I am so excited, guys, because today we are live on location at Lakewood Yacht Club. We are talking about the 25th annual Keels and Wheels Concourse de Elegance, right? That's correct. <laughs> and I am right here with Gary Garnett. He is one of the directors um, of Keels and Wheels. But Gary, what else do you do? Well, a little bit of everything this year. Uh, after the pandemic last year and not being able to have a show, we're so excited about having the 25th anniversary and moving forward in today's deal. So I handle media, advertising, public relations, uh, for the board, as amongst other things. Yeah, he does a lot of stuff. <laughs> He's got a major background and all that stuff, so it's really, it's really awesome to be him, here with him today. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you something. Kills and Wheels is always an amazing event, but this year, I have to tell you, I am really, really excited because you've got some amazing things happening and some incredible guests coming. We do. Um, this is awesome. Okay, so first of all, when is it? It is next weekend, May 1st and 2nd, Saturday and Sunday, from 9 to 5 on Saturday and from 9 to 4 on Sunday. Okay. And we're going to tell you how to get tickets and make sure you come to this event in just a little bit. Okay, so you have two Grand Marshals that I cannot wait to meet. I'm so excited. So how many of you have seen the Ford versus Ferrari movie? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I feel like five times. I love I love that show, and uh, and and my dad. I grew up because my dad is a car lover. So I've always been interested in, in all that stuff. Um, you have Aaron Shelby, which is the grandson of Carol Shelby, the American automotive designer and race car driver. How cool is that? That's and great. then okay. Peter Miles, who is the son of the British race car driver, Ken Miles. That's correct. I mean, this is crazy. This is very, very exciting. Okay, so um, Gary, tell us a little bit about how y'all came up with the theme for this year's event. Well, I've got to give credit to Bob Fuller, who was the founder of, uh, of Concours and has just networked with, with uh, car enthusiasts and people all over the world. And Bob came up with that. Uh, Tommy Hammond, uh, who uh, owns a GT and, and who knows, uh, knew Carroll Shelby personally. His father and Carroll Shelby were in the service together. Oh and one of the goodness. first cars that came to Texas came to Hammond Ford many, many years ago down in Texas City. Wow. So all of this started to develop. And as it developed, uh, we got the Ford and the Ferrari cars. And then Tommy kind of jumped in, and, and uh, they got hold of Aaron Shelby, the grandson, and he was just tickled to death. Uh, he wants to come and meet with Tommy and find out a lot of stories that he doesn't even know about his grandfather. So it's, it's kind of wow. a reunion-type deal, too. Um, Peter Miles obviously was involved in that. Uh, there's a good chance that we'll have Randall Shelby, uh, who is uh, Aaron's brother. Wow. Uh, we're waiting to see. They've got cars. But what, what is phenomenal that's happened is... Uh, Shelby America has jumped in behind this now, and they are bringing people from all over the country, California, Vegas, uh, Dallas area, all over, uh, bringing people to the show, um, different directors and different people of the Shelby Foundation. It is so exciting. And, and first of all, I have to give a shout out to Gary again, because we are sitting right on the back of his gorgeous boat <laughs> right here at Lakewood uh, Yacht Club Marina. And I know you wish you were here with us because it is fabulous and amazing and it's just so nice. It's, it's gorgeous today. Okay, so what's great is that Aaron Shelby is bringing his own GT. Possibly two um, of them. Possibly two. He's going to bring a Cobra and a GT. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, this is... The movie cars, right. So exciting. Okay, so um, y'all, you know, Kills and Wheels always an, is an, an amazing event every year. You can see... Uh, cars and boats that you will have never had the opportunity to see. You can see them at this event. What are some of the new things that y'all are going to be doing at Kills and Wheels this year? Because it's exciting. It is exciting. Uh, this year we have 75 boats, uh, classic and, and custom boats, that uh, is the largest array we've had in many years. I think it was a little over 40 in 19. Wow. Um, 
we are the only keels and wheels. We're the only boat and car show at the Allegans there is. There's wow. a few smaller ones, but we're the only ones. Bob and Paul Merriman started that many years ago. Uh, this year, we have 225 cars coming um, from the old iron, the Packers, the old cars, all of this, all the way up to the newer cars. Uh, and there's some surprises that may be here on a, a new GT that's just come out. Uh, there's not another one in the state of Texas. We think we have that one coming wow. at the last minute. Um, we have um, um, a new thing this year called Club Concours. All of the uh, car shows around the country, as well as golf tournaments and all this stuff, have gone to a kind of a, a, an elite type area. And we have launched Club Concours this year, which is a private um, area. It's a, um, you, you purchase a, um, an advanced ticket to it. The ticket is $250. It will include parking, um, early admittance, so you'll get to come in the show an hour before the general public. We have an area that's going to be roped off right by the, the, the uh, Ford and Ferrari. Uh, with, uh, you'll be, get, be served breakfast and lunch both days by Lighthouse Charity Team, which is one of our charities, and the Cole Garden Foundation, which is a new charity in honor of Cole Garden, a young man that, that passed away here a couple years ago in an accident. Uh, they will be cooking for that. Uh, we've got, the, you'll have a private bar um, in the area. And, and a lot of businesses are using it to be able to bring their people entertainment. Texas Mattress Makers, who's one of our largest sponsors, uh, has decided to make that their company party, and they're bringing 60 people uh, to Club Concours and to see the show. So let, fun. let us entertain them for them. Oh yeah, that, that is awesome. And if you've never heard of Texas Mattress Makers, you wanna find out about them because they are awesome and a huge company and they do some amazing things. And we are very, very excited that they are part, a right, huge right. part, of Kills and Wheels this year. Really, really amazing. And they not only do mattresses for your home, which are incredible, but they've now gotten into doing custom mattresses for your boats. So the mattresses on sailboats, or even this boat, are odd-shaped. They're, they're custom. And uh, Evolve has decided to make those uh, available, and I'm sure you could probably get one for your camper since it's the same type of situation. But they, we, we appreciate them a lot. They have really jumped in behind us this year and helped make things happen. Yeah, I love that. And if you have like family or friends that you don't really like a lot and you want to sleep them on your boat, you can put them in a corner and make a little triangle mattress. Three, three here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they can make any kind of mattress you want. That's the point, That's right? It. You got it. All right, okay, so Gary, uh, saltwater recon. This is very cool that you're all are having this year. It's two days of video and drone coverage. That's correct. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, that is this awesome. Is, this is something that we decided last year because of the pandemic and everybody was going virtual. Everything you've heard about over the last year is virtual. I'm so tired of virtual, it's not funny. I like the sunshine and the, and the camaraderie and the outdoors. But in doing that, we started this and Saltwater Recon is a, a, a fairly new company, several years old. They have cameras all up and down the coast. And all those cameras are accessible by you by merely signing up for their service. We have one sitting right back here on the point that's filming us as we speak from, from, from the air. So they're, they're back here filming us. There we go. Um, and <laughs> what we're doing this year is we're putting cameras up on the site. We'll have a roving camera that will start on Friday with a behind the scenes. Hopefully you can come out it, with us. And we'd love for you Absolutely. Oh, I will be there. And we will be filming this. We'll do one segment on Friday, two on Saturday, and two on Sunday. We're going to live feed this to Facebook and the Internet. Right now we're feeding to over a million people. Wow. As a live concourse. We are the first concourse, not only voting car, to ever go live and film with something like this. So we're excited about that, too. It's exciting. I'm going to tell you, every, every year, Kills and Wheels bring something really, really different and wonderful to this event. And it is something you do not want to miss. I'm going to tell you, whether you've been here since the beginning coming to these things, or, or this year you're thinking, I need to be there. You need to be at this event. I'm going to tell you, this is something really, really special. And you can help celebrate this 25th year. Uh, huge year, really, this and year. It is. And, and not only that, Kelly, we do this. We're a nonprofit organization. Uh, we have three charities, Lighthouse Charities, uh, Coal Garden Foundation, and the Harbor for kids over here. We've given over a million and a half dollars to charities over the years. So 
this is also a charitable event. Uh, Seabrook, League City, Kima, all the area loves this because we fill the hotels up. Yeah, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. And, and listen, you know, the, the great thing about this is that Kills and Wheels always gives back. And like he said, they are focusing on three amazing charities this year. And you can have fun with a purpose. And this is what this is. And this is why supporting these events is so important because you are not only having a good time, but you are helping to give back to really make a difference in this community and beyond. And I'm gonna tell you, Kills and Wheels does a great job of that. And we are very, very proud of this annual event um, that y'all do. Okay, so Gary, how can we get a ticket? That's a good question. Right now, you can go on the Kills and Wheels website and purchase the uh, pre-sale <coughs> of tickets, which the normal ticket of the gate is $40. If you pre-purchase them, they're $30. And children under 13 are free uh, with an adult coming in. You can also buy the Club Concourse passes online. Uh, you can buy one or you can buy 10 if you're a company or you want to bring a lot of people. It is a write-off. You're, 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 you can... Um, um, entertain your friends and whatever and, and write it off also because we're a 501. Yeah, that is that that is awesome to know. Um, okay, so one fun thing, well, another fun thing about this event is that you're going to have some replicas of the Academy Award winning movie Ford versus Ferrari, which is one of my favorite shows, seriously. Um, you're going to have some of the uh, Ford GTs replicas that were actually in the movie. Well, the two cars we have are the actual movie cars. That's okay? incredible. And then a lot of the cars, like Aaron Shelby's uh, Cobra and several of those others, were movie cars. Obviously, in the movie, there's lots of cars that are moving in and out and blowing up or whatever. But uh, <laughs> none of these, they blew up. Okay, that, they're, they're still good. But uh, we have a lot of cars. Plus, we have a lot of people from the, from the that own Cobras and GTs yeah. and, and the Mustang Mocks and all those. We have all those. And this year is going to be a huge display of, uh, of cars. I am so excited. So if somebody has never been to Kills and Wheels and they are coming this year because it's going to be so awesome. I'm so excited. What can people expect as soon as they walk in the area? What are, what's going to happen? That's a good question. Um, you'll, they'll be part. The, Lakewood has 36 acres of manicured grounds on, on this site right here with boats and, and tennis courts. We have one of the largest uh, children's programs of sailing in the country. We send kids to Australia and all over the world. But with that said, we don't have a lot of parking, not for all the thousands of people who come. It's boat parking. So, huh? Boat parking. We have boat parking. Now, you can come by boat. There'll probably be an empty slip. Uh, if you need that, just call me. Um, but we have parking lots all up and down NASA Road 1, 146, and all this area, and we're running buses from those areas to Kills and Wheels to the front gate. So um, uh, probably stay to the, uh, to the side. 146 is under construction, as you know. It, uh, it's not going to be real bad. I don't think it's going to impact us, but there's lots of parking lots down NASA Road 1 and into Highway 3 and back down that area. When you come in the gate, uh, you'll get your ticket, or if you already have your ticket, you'll come in next day. And as you walk in the uh, entrance to that, there's nothing but oak trees that these cars are parked under and, uh, and amongst. Lots of shade. Uh, as you wander through these cars and talk to some of the owners, uh, it's amazing. Bring your kids, because kids love to see these old cars particularly, us younger my grandkids <laughs> love to see those and of course they know the Fords and the GTs and all these modern cars and the Carvettes and the and the different ones like this but it's it's as you go around through the area uh, you'll come to the main parking lot which is where the the Ford and GT will be displayed in a tent you've got vendors around that area you've got sponsors you've got food you've got drink lighthouse charities will have a full service kitchen on the ground south there uh, and as you come around the corner and you open your eyes, you'll see the inner harbor of Lakewood, which has 73 boats parked in it. Wow. This is probably the most phenomenal sight that you'll ever see with an array of, of, of antique boats, custom boats, uh, and, and, and that. Uh, as you continue to walk down, there'll be cars spaced all through. It's kind of like a stage setting where the cars are mixed in amongst the yacht club, which is a setting that nobody can duplicate. Yeah, I'm going to tell you, 
You want to bring your kids, your dad, your brother, your cousins, your friends, your neighbors, because this is something that you don't get to see all the time. That's right. And Lakewood Yacht Club and Kills and Wheels brings it right to us right here in the Clear Lake area. It is absolutely amazing. The tickets are affordable, guys. This is what's so nice, and it goes to charities. Um, you're making a difference, and so it's fun with a purpose right here at Kills and Wheels. Um, okay, so Gary, if we um, if we if we get here at nine, do, should people? try to park inside it starts at nine or should you go ahead and try to no, find go a, to park a parking lot there is okay. really no inside parking okay um that's used for the vendors and obviously lakewood still goes on the other thing neat about this that a lot of people don't understand is all of our volunteers everyone that is working keels and wheels is a volunteer who is a member of lakewood yacht club have done it for years and years and years our parking committee our uh welcoming committee everybody here is a volunteer and is a member of lakewood yacht club and proud to show off their club yeah it's wonderful hey listen this isn't just looking from afar at something and admiring something you actually get up close and personal Walk up to them. can find out about all of these boats and these cars ask questions to the owners okay so gary if somebody would like to be a part of this next year and enter their car or their boat how do they do that uh, we have an online website, which you can go on keelsandwheels.com, and you can register your car and your boat. We have a car selection committee that goes in. Um, I own a number of cars. None of mine are of the level. I've got one that I have, but none of mine really are the level of entering in a, con uh, in a concourse. We get hundreds and hundreds of applications, wow. and, the, and the best cars are picked. They're not only coming from Houston, though. We've got huge cars coming from California, from the Northeast. They're bringing them in 18-wheelers down here to show. So we wow. have a lot of cars that do nothing but make the, make the circuit and make the shows. We've got Jaguars that have won international and national um, uh, trophies. Um, so it's, it's not just a local car show. If you go to Home Depot or, or one of the coffee and cars and you see all these cars, they're beautiful cars. These are the creme de la creme. These are the best cars around the nation, not just Houston. Absolutely. It is so exciting. And listen, guys, it's a two-day event, May 1st and 2nd, but if you come down a little bit early, if you're coming from out of town or even just a little bit away, stay the night, mm -hmm. see some of the sights in this area because there's so many fun things to do, and then you're already here to wake up early, come on out to Kills and Wheels, and be ready to go and have a great time. You're going to be making memories That'll last you for a lifetime. I'm going to tell you, and this year, you're going to want to be here. The 25th annual Kills and Wheels right here at Lakewood Yacht Club. And um, we've got very special guests coming this year. And, Gary, one more time, tell them who is going to be at well, we've this got, event. We've got Aaron Shelby and Peter Miles, who are our Grand Marshals. They will be signing autographs. And I want to say the lanyards and the, and the passes that Club Concourse has are gorgeous. They're laminated collector's items, and Aaron and Peter will be signing those. Wow. We also have Barry Warner, who is the chairman and the founder of Amelia Island Concours, coming as a guest. We have Barry McGuire. All of you use McGuire products and wax and wash and all this stuff. They'll be here. Uh, we have numerous other people that, that will be here um, as guests. Uh, I've got a lot of people coming from Shelby America, Shelby International, uh, their PR people, their president. Um, and, and the same way with Cobra. So we honestly don't even know who all is going to show up, uh, but but <laughs> the, the, uh, Kelly's going to be here. I'm going to be there. Um, the uh, the people that are inquiring about it this year, we've been we've been locked up for a long time, guys, and and it's time to get out in the sun. I mean, look at this beautiful weather and cars. We're the first big car show this year, period. So if you come to this, it's the 25th anniversary. It's not only our anniversary, but it's something moving forward and starting a new era in the in the years to come. Uh, absolutely. So. I'm going to tell you, this is the event you do not want to miss. Um, Gary, thank you so much for hosting us on this fabulous boat. It's Anytime. gorgeous. I'm coming to spend the night sometime. <laughs> um, I'm not going to sleep on the triangle bed. Okay. <laughs> Um, guys, we are so happy that you've joined us today. Do not miss the 25th annual 
Heels and Wheels right here at Lakewood Yacht Club, May 1st and 2nd. It is going to be an event that you want to bring your family, your friends, your neighbors um, to make memories and see up close and personal some of the most beautiful and amazing cars and boats you'll ever see in the country. There's nothing like it, and it's right here at Lakewood Yacht Club. Gary, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Kelly. I'm glad that we get this out to all the people and they know that there's a place to go for the first and second of May. By the way, I think that might be Mother's Day weekend, so bring Mother out. It's not Mother's Day? <laughs> <laughs> that is next it's week. Pre bring them out for pre-Mother's oh, Day the weekend. All right, well then bring them out yeah. for pre-Mother's Day. <laughs> that's <Okay. laughs> right. <laughs> I like the way you think, though. See, that's so sweet. <laughs> okay, guys, thank y'all so much for watching the Kelly Williams Show today. And thank you so much, Gary, for thank hosting you, us. Kelly. This has been so much fun to learn about this amazing event coming up, Kills and Wheels, 25th anniversary, right here at Lakewood Yacht Club. And we will see you there. Bye.